All right, everybody. We are going to be starting to talk about the growth stage now. I hope you're excited because this is where we're going to take our product to the next level. We're going to be rapidly expanding the sales on our product in this stage. We're going to do it in a controlled way, but our aim here is to get as many sales as possible because we're really going to be taking advantage of this fresh product that's in the market. Right? We're selling the product already at this point. We're getting PPE ads up. We're getting click to website ads up. We're getting conversions on our product and the market is responding very well. Now we're going to expand it and we're gonna go up that ramp in the growth period and make sure that we're getting that out there to as many people as possible before we have the even chance of being ripped off by our competition. So we're gonna introduce the website conversion ads at this point. So we need to have that matured pixel, right? We are gonna group our interests here uh, and then we're going to more split out on the demographic side of things and the, the platform side of things. Uh, and then leverage our matured pixel for that to be finding the right people to go after. So just to put it in perspective of where we are right now, we're gonna have a proven product and it's the time to scale. This is where you maybe have gotten 50 to 100 sales off the click to website and the PPE ads that have matured that pixel for you and have gotten you ready for the website conversion ads. So you can see on the ramp here, we're moving up towards the maturity stage in the growth period. This is everybody's favorite time is where you really get some damage done um, as far as getting some profit when you have a new product in the market and people are just wanting to buy it rapidly as fast as they can. All right, in terms of our targeting, we're gonna be going after the converter section here, if you remember this graph. These are gonna be the brand loyal people, people that have constant marketing pushed to them by other big companies, right? Think about how much marketing is done by the larger companies in your niche. We're gonna be leveraging that because those people are keeping our people, the people we wanna target, loyal to the niche. Not only the brand, but the niche as well. So if you can see here on our graph, you got a quick converters overlapping with engagers and clickers. We already have the engagers and the clickers being targeted, right? We have our PPE add up, we have our click to website add up. Now we're bringing in the converters and leveraging all the work that we've done to this point. So if you are very fast up to this point, right? If you have a hot product, you got immediately 50 to 100 sales and you got lots of conversions, or if you already had a matured pixel, you can come straight to the website conversion. It doesn't really matter how much time is going on between the introduction of your product to this point. What's important is that your pixel is matured and you have preferably over 100. I say 50 to 100, but it should really be over 100 pixel fires until you get a real good idea who you're going after. The, and we can go over this in, in a later video, the pixel is a lot like the audience insight tool. If you enter in a very small interest into the tool, you're not gonna have a lot of information on you know, the correlations between these people. If you get a good amount of information or you get a good sized audience, say you know, 50 to 100,000 people, you can start drawing correlations within that audience, right? They know exactly who this audience is because they have enough people to draw correlations through. If you have only a few, a thousand or so, it's gonna really have that um, a difficult time doing those correlations and you're not gonna get a lot of results on the page likes tab. Or you're gonna get mega brands like Amazon or Walmart or things like that that everybody in the country has some association with. Those will also fall in if you don't have enough people. We're looking for enough information for them to really know who to go after in terms of our niche. Okay, and then we're gonna point them in the right direction and get them on started on the path with our targeting. But we don't have to be as specific as we did with the other two, which don't leverage the conversion pixel, okay? So we'll see you in the next video. We're gonna start talking about what to do next and start our setting up our ads.